Fit for a Feast. My name is Sloan. And my name is Katrina. And today here on Fit for a Feast, we will be making apple salsa since apples are now in season. This is a really healthy snack that's yummy too. You can use any type of eating apples, but we decided to use Granny Smith and Macintosh. We went apple picking for the Macintosh apples. This is a really great recipe to use because if you have bruises on the apples, you can just cut around to use them. So that way you don't waste food. So I'm gonna start by chopping the apples into small pieces. Remember the nice safety video, so you know where to put your fingers. So while Sloan's cutting the apple, I'm gonna start cutting our next ingredient, which is the bell pepper. We're gonna use multicolored bell peppers, but you can use any one you find. So you can just use like a green or a red, any one you find. Cut the bell pepper in half going around. After you cut it, you're just gonna peel this part out. It's musty, careful. <laughs> then just remove all the seeds and stuff in the inside. Do the same with the other half. Once you've got your peppers ready, you're gonna chop these into small pieces too. Once you're done chopping the food, it should look like this. The next thing we're gonna add is lime juice. It gives good flavor and it keeps the apples from turning brown. So we need a quarter cup of lime juice. So now since it's a quarter cup, we're gonna pour it over the apples. The next thing to add is onions. You can use red onions, but we're gonna use green. So chop these into small pieces as well. So while someone's cutting the onions, I'm gonna get the cilantro ready. Cilantro is also known as coriander. If you don't like cilantro, you can also use the regular for this recipe. So now I'm gonna pull off the leaves from the stem and once I have the leaves pulled off, I'm gonna chop them up fine. We need a quarter cup of chopped fresh cilantro. So I've got my onions chopped into little pieces in the bowl and now I'm gonna pour it into this big bowl. So now I got my cilantro leaves ready, so I'm gonna use this safety chopper and chop them really fine. So now we're gonna add salt. Instead of using regular salt, we're gonna use either sea salt or aromatic sea salt. The difference with the aromatic is that it has different flavors added into it. So I'm gonna use the aromatic salt. You need half a teaspoon. So now my leaves are chopped fine, so now I'm gonna add them to the bowl. So now we're gonna add some mild green chilies, which we have here. If you like it spicier, you can add jalapeno peppers too. We're only gonna put some jalapeno peppers though because we don't like it too spicy. We've also chopped one garlic clove, which we're gonna add too. So there's only two ingredients left. So I'm gonna pour one tablespoon of olive oil. And now we're gonna add one tablespoon of apple cider vinegar. So now we got everything in there, so now we're just gonna take a big spoon and stir it up. If you have leftover turkey from your Thanksgiving dinner and you're making turkey tacos, this is a great topping. So we're gonna use ours as an appetizer. We're gonna use tortilla chips. We prefer the multigrain or the blue corn chips. It looks so colorful. It kind of reminds me of the leaves in fall. Bon appetit. Whoopsies. Looks well, yummy. <laughs> this recipe and a lot of others are on our website. See you later on Fit for a Feast. Bye. Bye. <laughs> yummy.